Good morning everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Keegan, hello. Today, welcome to a day in my life. So far today, you guys saw I made my bed. I actually did some work and now we're here. So far we've gotten a good day started. It's almost 11 a.m. right now. I almost said p.m., can you imagine? I was supposed to have a workout. I do like group training two days a week and I was supposed to go in at 8.30 and I woke up at 7.30, texted the girl and I was like, I can't do it. I was like, I'm not feeling well. I'm feeling fine. I just couldn't, I just needed to sleep. So I was planning on working out and I just couldn't bring myself to do it. I was so exhausted this morning actually. I turned an app limit. I, I have an app limit on for TikTok and I'm always like 15 minutes more, 15 minutes more, 15 minutes more. And so I made an app limit where, wait, I'll show you guys. Where's my phone? Let me show you. Okay, this is my phone. You're gonna recognize me? Oh, it did. As you can see, my screen time has been up so much because of TikTok because I'll be scrolling on TikTok until 2 a.m. in the morning and I need to stop doing that. So I made a downtime from 10 to 7 a.m. Always allowed so these are the apps that you allow yourself to go on during your downtime they're all allowed except for TikTok. So I literally did that. I remember when I was like, TikTok is lame, that's stupid. Look at me now. Why is my shirt out? Today, actually, I want to take you guys shopping with me. I need more summer clothes. I already did a haul recently. I'll link it down below. But the one thing that I really miss that I need is shorts. I literally don't own a single pair of shorts that I like. Every single pair of shorts, they're either too big or too small on me. I got some from Zara that are really cute, except for, I don't know if you can see my nipples. I have a really short torso. So the Zara jeans, like this is where my boots start the zara jeans go up to here so it just is like weird see how these start like at a good place i need shorts like start here not here so that is the main goal for today if we find a couple cute like tops not gonna say no oh i also have a forever 21 return that i need to do i also have laundry that i might do today i got some really cute tops from forever 21 like a week or so ago like a lot of them were just like really cute basics so maybe i'll do like a little haul after i do my laundry because i've worn all of them <laughs> they're all in there but maybe i'll do a quick little haul of the ones that i got for you guys because i didn't vlog the day that I went shopping because I wasn't planning on going shopping. I was just returning something and I was like, oh, that's cute. That's cute. That's cute. And it was all very cheap. So I'm going to get ready. I already like washed my face and everything, but there's no way that I can go out in like 110 degrees heat wearing leggings and then like a white t-shirt. There's just no way. So I'm going to get dressed. This is the outfit that I went with. I thought that since I'll be changing a lot, it might be helpful to have an outfit that's like easier to like throw on and off. These are really cute shorts from Princess Polly. The shirt is from American Eagle. I got it like a while ago. Oh, and then I want to throw on my necklaces. Let's walk over to the necklaces. Oh, my ankle. Ow, ow. This one is like a cute little choker from Etsy. This one is the birth year necklace and literally everyone has one of these. I'll link this one down below. It's from Amazon. It was less than $10 and most people literally spend like 50 to 100 on these. So I'll link this one down below. It's such a great deal and it's great quality too okay here's how the necklace this is like the weirdest angle here's how the necklaces look i don't know if you guys can see but i'm on my very last couple weeks of accutane you guys probably know i talk about it all the time i know this might look like nothing to you guys my skin's been breaking out so much it's not anywhere near what it used to be before i started but my skin was so clear no breakouts in sight and now that i'm like finishing up accutane every morning i wake up with a new breakout has this happened to anyone else is this just me i'm like freaking out like what is causing me to break out but i don't no. If this happened to anyone else, please let me know. Okay, let's go to the mall. Don't want to forget my Forever 21 bag. We just got to the mall. I genuinely have no idea where I park, so it's gonna be hard to find this spot again. I don't even know how to get out of here. Like, no clue. Every time I come to this mall, I park somewhere different and I never know where I am. <laughs> I cannot find any of the stores that I'm looking for and I'm probably one of the only people wearing a mask in this whole mall. Oh, I miss Build-A-Bear Workshop so much. I'm gonna take my mask off because we're alone. I think I might already own these from years ago, but I still do like them. I mean, they're kind of short. I feel like I'd chafe, but they fit well. I think I own them, but I'm not sure. Do we like these? I feel like they're a size bigger than I should be, so I got a size up and a size down because you didn't have my size. And I mean, they fit my waist. I mean, like, you know, it's comfortable. I'm worried if this is too loose here though, you know? Like, I feel like it looks a little baggy. I'm gonna try on the size smaller, and if that doesn't, I, mm, I don't know. One weird thing is there's like a lot of fabric there. I assumed that those were the ones that were bigger than my size that I thought I was because they were just big on me. No, these are the ones that are too big. So maybe I'm like a lower size than I think I am. I don't know. I don't think I need to wear a size two though. Okay, these are cute and they fit, but I feel like these ones are also a size down from the size I think I am. And I feel like they 
fit well, but I'm like, I don't know. I feel like I'd be better in a size six than this. I mean, they fit perfectly, but I'm just like, what if I eat? <laughs> yeah, the eights are too big. I feel like the fours fit, but I feel like a six would be more comfortable, you know? But they don't have a six, but I feel like I would like the six more. They don't have any size sixes anywhere in this store. Double zeros, twos, maybe a couple fours, and then eights and twelves, that's it. I feel so confused. Maybe I am a size four because these, this pair and this pair that I haven't tried on yet are sixes. It's so big on me. But are these cute? I can't tell. I can't tell if they're cute or not. But I'm like, maybe I am a size for them, but that also feels wrong somehow. I don't know. I think this pair is a little too high waist on me. Like my belly button's literally here. But again, I mean like they fit better than the other pair of sets. I hate women's jeans because they're constantly different. I feel like these are probably enough. I like these, but I think, again, I want to try a six and I feel like, and they don't have one, but I like them. Now I'm in PacSun. I just went to Zara for the first time ever. The line was short. Okay, I'm having buyer's remorse about what I bought from American Eagle. The guy was so helpful, but he was saying, he was like, we just got a shipment in and we don't put it out until tomorrow. So I'm like, so all the cute stuff that I wasn't sure about my size, if I just went tomorrow, I would have been able to figure that out. Oh my God, I saw the cutest dog at Zara. I showed you guys a video of him. He was five months old, so cute. And then I just got a few little tops. But we're in PacSun. They have the cutest colors. And you guys know I love these colors. So I'm gonna try them on. Those are so cute. I love them. Oh, I want those. I didn't even see those. We're gonna try stuff on. But I don't really know how these types of sizes work. These are 27s and I only know like six, eight, like those kind of sizes. So these are cute. I don't know if I love this. A little big, but they're like comfortable. Are these the exact same pair of shorts? I think they are. Tell me why these are the exact same pair of shorts. Same size, but these ones fit me better than those ones that were the exact same size. Okay, cute, but the straps aren't adjustable. So that's the only thing because there's like a lot of strap fabric. So I feel like it would easily fall really low but i think it's cute this is a maybe very cute very spring i think it's like a little long what if i just like i think this outfit together is cute right thoughts i love this i like this so much more than i thought i was going to like i thought it was going to be like right here like this part would be right here and i would like flash people i think this is so cute well actually what if i'm bloated oh no i'm struggling because i can't tell if all these tops are cute or if they're just really unflattering like i have no idea like i just can't tell i think this one's a no why are none of these cute me. I think I like this one. I just can't tell anymore. I feel like I can't tell. I have no idea what I want to get and what I don't want to get. These are maybes. These are no's. This is also a maybe. I can't tell. I didn't get anything from PacSun because I didn't love anything. And then I went to Forever 21 and I got a few things. I keep shopping with the mindset if I don't like it when I get home I can return it. I'm trying to find like a Levi's or something with like good short because I need shorts and that's the whole reason I'm here and I haven't found any so. We're in Abercrombie right now. I feel like I'm in some expensive airplane. Look at this place right like what there's even what and what it was locked and then when i came in the lights like went up it was so cool is there like a national size six shortage because there is not one single size six in this entire store i have two things we're gonna try on so much for this thing because i'm trying to play with it and it won't work so <laughs> okay so i'm trying on this bodysuit and then these shorts this bodysuit is really cute and it's a thong bodysuit which i like because no underwear lines it's not doing me any favors here and then these shorts i mean like i think they're cute i think they fit really well but are they a little long i'm worried they're a little long because normally most shorts like would cut off like just like a, like a little bit before they're not long enough to roll but they fit so well like very comfortably my butt showing they don't do much for my butt but what butt do i have i mean i kind of like this look i'm gonna try on these shorts with the t-shirt that i brought they also might be a little too high waisted my belly buttons are right here what do we think this is one of the tops i got from zara i love it i'm just like are these too long well you know what i can always come back because there's a million sizes fours a million i love this top though i'm in levi's i'm the only person in this store i have some jeans and then a few pairs of shorts the cutest shorts didn't have my size <laughs> they're so big they're so big they're cute but they're like a little long this is a 26 i have also a 28 and i feel like i'd be a 27 <sighs> these are hideous i hate them did I just find the perfect pair? Literally the last pair I tried for today. They're like a little big, like a little, but I feel like a size smaller would be too tight. How much are they? They're not a horrible price. I like them. I kind of want to try the size down, but I feel like this will probably be it. So this is that same pair in a different wash, but in the size, like a size smaller. 
Yeah, so no. <laughs> I really like these jeans. I just wish they weren't so long. I could always get them hemmed, but like for the amount of money that I'd be spending, I wouldn't want to. Oh my gosh, I have so much to tell you. I genuinely feel like you guys are my best friends and I get so excited to tell you things. You have no idea. Whenever I have a thought and I'm like, I want to tell them, I like get so excited and I can't do anything else until I tell you guys. Like, I'm not kidding. You guys are just like my whole world. Okay, anyways, these smallest little things happen and I'm like, oh my God, I get to tell them. I'm so excited. I'm sorry about this. So I ended up buying just the one pair of Levi shorts that were like a little big on me. The other pair was too small and I'd rather have them be too big than small. And when I was trying them on, I hadn't like had like a full meal yet. So they're shorts that I could grow in. I do think though that I might go to American Eagle tomorrow in my hometown. I don't know if I want to drive all the way back out here on a weekend. This mall gets crazy on the weekends. I also forgot to return the Forever 21 stuff. I forgot to bring the bag in with me. There's a car. It literally just shook the whole parking garage. I felt like a little shake. I also got Panda Express. I have not had Panda Express for over a year just because of the pandemic and everything i don't know when i was younger whenever my mom would take me and my sister to the mall we would always get panda express like before we left so it's just like a little childhood memory that i was like i want to relive it and then i also went to sephora i'm debating if i want to do a haul in this video of all the stuff that i got or if i want to just do a separate video i feel like this video is kind of long i'll show you guys what i got from sephora i got olaplex the shampoo and conditioner my sister got me a sephora gift card for my birthday and i haven't used it yet so i was like this is what i want to use it on i really want to focus on like getting my hair to stop falling out. And then I went into Fabletics because there's a Fabletics store and if you sign up, you get that like two for 24 deal there. And I was like, I have a lot of emails that I could use, but there was this like really annoying couple that was just standing right where I wanted to be. And I was like, uh, like I'll just, no. But I do need more workout clothes. That couple was really annoying. So I was just like, whatever, never mind. And then I ended up going back into Zara. That shirt, do you know the, the nude one that I tried on? So good, I only got it in two colors. And I was like, I kind of want to go back and buy it in every single color because that was so flattering. But then when I walked in, the line was long and I was like, heck no, heck nope not worth it and then i left i actually found my car really well because i don't know if you guys can see, you got it's so washed out i literally took pictures of everywhere that i parked like every notable place that i could remember where i parked why do these look like a good like photo dump like style photo i literally felt like dora explorer with a map but instead of a map i had my iphone photos that i took in places so i wouldn't get lost i'm about to go home i'm really thirsty i was gonna bring a water bottle but then i didn't it's rush hour right now so it's gonna be a long ride home I'm home now. All the stuff I bought. <laughs> there was this guy that was in the hallway like painting some of the units and I was like trying to take a photo of the paint like color whatever that they use for this apartment because eventually like, we're gonna take these down and like all of our stuff. He walked out right as I was doing it and I was like, you know what color paint this is? And he was like, white? And I was like, that is not white. That's like a beigey cream. I think I'm gonna show you guys all of this stuff in a haul because I have the other stuff from Forever 21 and that's quite a bit of stuff. We'll just have a haul. Ah, get excited. Woo. I've been scrolling on TikTok since I can't go on it at night. I can go on it during the day. I'm trying to be a ring person now. These are some rings that I got from Forever 21. What do you guys think? I feel like I play with rings so often, so I'm trying to like get used to them. I feel like this hand is good. I don't like how they're all on one side, but this is my left hand, so it's not like I can put one here and then none of them can fit my pinky. And then I tried stacking them, but they don't look good stacked. I also like the chubbiest fingers ever. I like this hand. I feel like this hand is good. What do you guys think? I don't know. But this video is probably super long. I'm not really doing anything for the rest of the day. See, I'm playing with the rings. Ah! I think I'm probably just gonna end the video here because I have nothing else to do. I love you guys so much. If you're not subscribed, make sure to subscribe. And I love you. Okay, bye. <laughs>